Hello everyone, here is a new video of Magento Marketplace Multi Vendor Module. This Multi Vendor Module is very much popular among the Magento users. And in this video, I will show you how you can add a configurable product. So, firstly, you have to log in to your sellers panel so here I will log into my sellers panel this is our demo sellers panel now you can see your Magento dashboard and in dashboard you can find marketplace menu so you have to click on new products to add a product here add new product page is shown so you have to select attribute set I will select default attribute set and you have to select product type so I will select configurable product but to add configurable product you have to add some attributes for this configurable products so we will add attributes from create attribute so we will create attributes from here manage configurable product attributes so here I will select attribute set now I will select attribute group you can select any attribute set or attribute group now I will write attribute code I will add color as an attribute attribute label you have to write the attribute label name label as the name of attribute now you have to select the input type you can select the multi select option or you can select the drop down so I have selected the drop down so these options have been displayed by selecting the drop down menu so here I will add the color options like red default store view red position 1 I will add another option which is blue in default store view it is also blue and position is 2 so you can add any number of attributes from this add option button or you can delete options from this delete button so I have selected two options or I have entered or added two options in color attribute so now I will go and save this attribute here you can see a success message will be shown attribute created successfully so I will create another attribute attribute set is default attribute group is general now attribute code you can add any attribute code like I am adding size attribute label you have to name the attribute as a size catalog input type I will select drop down values required no or if you select yes then it will be a mandatory field so I will set it as no now I will write or enter the size small in small and position is 1 add another option large 
large and second add another option xl xl position is 3 so I will go and save this attribute here is again the success message so now here our two attributes has been added in our attribute set so now we will go again to uh, to new product page to add a new configurable product so we will select the attribute set now we will select the product type we will select the configurable product now I will click on continue so here you can see a message is shown select configurable attribute so I will select the color and size which we have added recently so now I will click on create configurable product so here is a page where we can add a new configurable product so at first we have to select the category in which we have to add our product now we have to name our product here round neck tees I have written product name as round neck tees you can write anything what according to your needs or whatever you want so description you can write anything on description about your product now you have to write this short description now you have to enter the SKU it must be unique for every product now you have to write the price now you can write special price date from to now you have to set the status or you can say stock availability now you can select visibility of this product you can select not visible individually catalog or search or both catalogs and search tax class you can add tax classes I will select none now you can choose images from here so I'll go and choose images of my t-shirt here is a red t-shirt now I will add more image by clicking on add more image you can add extra images so I have uploaded two images for the t-shirt now I will select a base image from these two I'll select blue as the base image now I will go and save this product so you must be thinking I haven't created any associated products related to the attributes so here I can manage the associated products here you can see product has been created successfully a success message now you can add associated products so here I will write red t-shirt as the name of associated product now the SKU will be unique so I will I have written red one now weight of the product visibility not visible individually quantity you have to write the quantity you can manage inventory from here you can select color so 
here is the red color this is our attribute made which we have made recently so you can write price of the attribute or you can write zero or you can left it blank now we have to select the size I'll select large now I will quick create a product now you can see a success message will be shown associated product created successfully now I will make some more products quickly like blue blue L blue large SKU BL weight 10 so I have created many products with this combination of red blue excel large and small so i will show you my added products right now so i will create this product associated product now i will show you all the product list which i have created for these are the products which i have created right now i will click on save associated products and these products will be saved with our configurable product so now we will go to our clothing here is the clothing page or you can say category page clothing but or you can say our recently added product round neck tees we will click on this and we can see here is our product is shown so you can choose and color option you can choose from blue and red I will choose red and you can choose any size of the red t-shirt I will select the large size you can see pictures of blue and red t-shirts so you can also manage your products by going to your my account then you have to click on my product list here you can see all your products which we have added recently this is round neck t-shirt and these are the associated products you can edit them by clicking on this edit icon So here you can add more associated products you can change category or add another category you can change all those fields you can enable or disable this product you can change the images or add new images to the products so that's all for this video so i hope you have understood how you can add a configurable product in magento marketplace you can find more beneficial videos and thank you for watching this video and stay connected